Genesis chapter 50 brings the narrative of Joseph and his family to a poignant and fulfilling conclusion, underscoring themes of forgiveness, reconciliation, and the providential workings of God. Following Jacob's death, Joseph weeps and mourns for his father, a touching display of filial love. He honors Jacob's request to be buried in Cana and leads a grand procession, which includes Pharaoh's officials and chariots, to lay Jacob to rest in the cave of Machpelah. Upon returning to Egypt, Joseph's brothers are seized by fear that he might seek revenge for their past betrayal now that their father is gone. In an intimate and compassionate moment, Joseph reassures them. He acknowledges God's overarching plan, explaining that their actions were part of a divine orchestration to bring about their eventual preservation. Joseph's reassurance exemplifies the transformative power of forgiveness. He acknowledges his brother's guilt, but absolves them of blame, emphasizing that God's greater purpose was at work. The chapter also portrays Joseph's magnanimity, as he extends his forgiveness to his brother's descendants, offering them comfort and protection. This gesture reflects Joseph's remarkable journey from a betrayed brother to a merciful leader. Genesis chapter 50 culminates with Joseph's death at the age of 110. He lives to witness three generations of his descendants, and before his passing, he reassures his brothers once again of God's promises and foretells their eventual return to the land of Canaan. Joseph's life story epitomizes God's redemptive plan. His reconciliation with his brothers, despite their past wrongs, becomes a beacon of hope and an embodiment of divine grace. The chapter highlights the cyclical nature of God's covenant promises as Joseph's death draws parallels to Jacob's. Both patriarchs express their desire to be buried in Canaan reaffirming their faith in God's covenant with Abraham. Genesis chapter 50 offers a powerful closing to the book, intertwining themes of forgiveness, legacy, and divine providence. It portrays the fulfillment of God's covenant through the lives of the patriarchs and sets the stage for the subsequent narrative of the Exodus and the journey of the Israelites.